My name is Narelle Henry, and I'm here with Eric Woods, number 75, on our Spartans football team. So, Eric, do you feel that anything was lacking from your game on Friday? Uh, yes, I feel like I took more players off than I should have. I could have executed more with me being who I am. I could have did more for the team. And can you elaborate on who you are when it comes to your role for the team? I feel like I play a big role to where our defense, I stop the runs, I create holes for the linebackers to run through. Mm -hmm. So how will you improve on the flaws that you mentioned earlier when you make it on to playoffs? Um, take practice more seriously and get more, more extra work done when we don't have practice on my own. So according to Max Preps, you stand at six foot and five inches and you weigh 325 pounds. That's correct. How do you use your physique to your advantage? Um, over in my training, I've realized it means a lot to be my size and what I can do to mm -hmm. other people and just me being who I am. Exactly, you play a big role on the team. So Eric, at what stage in your football career did you realize that you were physically gifted? Uh, I would say in middle school to where I have my coaches work to me and how much they worked on me to get me to where I am. What are some of the things that you did? Um, just in middle school, I was just the most physical, the strongest on the team to where I could, I knew and my coaches knew what I could do. So are you planning on continuing football in college? Yes. Have you thought about what college you want to attend? I would like to attend U of H. It's a great school. Well, it was an honor having you here on the Spartan Blitz, and we'd love to see you guys again next time. Hi, my name is Narelle Henry, and I'm here with Elijah F. Loise, number 48, our outside linebacker for the Spartans football team. So, Elijah, what aspects in your games do you think you can improve on when going into the Bay City game this week? Um, being more aware, reading my keys, reading my guards. Um, this week, I'm going to have to step up and be a leader. A lot, a lot of our starters are injured, so being a role model for those younger guys is a major priority in this next game. What do you think you can improve on when going into the next game? Do you look at any footage or anything to help improve yourself? Film is an important part in preparing for the next game. Um, kind of watching my position, they aren't the same size as me, so seeing how where I could fit, uh, how I could face the adversity um, I'm going to face on the field is watching film is very important to me. Mm -hmm. So what do you think your chances are for making it into playoffs this year? Uh, I think it's a high chance. You know, even though our, our guys, some of our guys are out, I feel like we have, if we play, how we've been playing, spread the culture, so that's something we always do. Play fast, play physical, that's kind of our motto at Stafford. And we just do what we've always been doing, playing as a team, I feel like we'll get a spot in, in the playoffs. So you seem pretty passionate about football. Is that something you plan to continue through college? No, unless the opportunity presents itself. I love football. I've been playing it my whole life. But I also love math. Uh, I want to be an engineer, a mechanical engineer or a computer engineer. Any sort of engineering because that's, that's also what I'm good at besides football. That's an amazing skill to have. Is there anything else that you do in your free time? I play a lot of video games. Um, 2K, Madden, um, I, I love Madden. I've been playing it since I was a little boy and that's kind of what helped develop my liking, my love for football is Madden, so I always appreciate that game. I still play it until this day. That's amazing. Well, it was an honor having you here on the Spartan Blitz and we'll see you guys again next time.